Hi, Alan. Hi, Billy. Hi, Ernie. Gee, you were just great, just great. Oh, gee, thanks. You know, I don't know whether I ought to speak to you guys or not. Why is that? Well, the only way I can get more publicity than you is to go up Broadway without my underwear. <laughs> yeah, well, the next time it'll be Alan here doing the Lady Godiva, not Arnie Haynes. Say, Bill, I know you're going into the Castle Theater next week, but what are your plans after that? Well, just a few recordings we have to make. Hey, maybe you can do us a favor. Can you take over some of our dates? Man, you can't retire. The government needs your taxes. <laughs> no, just a little vacation. Man, I'm tired. Well, it's possible, Arnie. I'll have my manager get in touch with your booking office in the morning. I think it can be worked out. Good, that's swell. Anytime we can repay the favor, you just let us know. Well, how about listening to my new tune, Goofing Around, see if you dig it. So, love to hear, Bill. Well, park yourselves. Sit down, Arnie. Thanks. Here, have a good look, Bill. Arnie Haynes has ruined us. Every booking we had across the country has been canceled. Well, how do you like that? He wants a vacation, so he takes us all with him. Thanks for bringing me the good news. How we doing, Dad? Newspaper gal digging us? Yeah, real deep. She sounds like she has us plowed way under already. That's freedom of the press. Yeah, and I always thought freedom of the press was a tailor who irons your suits for nothing. <laughs> Shows you. Hey, we're on next. You better get set, brother. OK, the rest of the boys are backstage. Good. Well, at least the latest communique from Mellondale is a good one. Mayor Bagley is sound asleep. Who would ever think 500 kids would keep a secret? Yeah. Looks like the younger generation has some character after all, eh? 